Hi guys, so my name is Sean and my topic is about polystyrene and so what is polystyrene and what is it used for? Okay. So uh, polystyrene is inexpensive, hard plastic and probably polyethylene is more common use it in everyday life. Um, polystyrene like other materials start with distillation of hydrocarbon fuels into lighter group called fractions. Polystyrene is naturally transparent thermoplastic that can be solid plastic as well as a rigid foam material. Okay. Here on the right side you can see the chemical structure of polystyrene. You see the large benzene ring a structure adds rigidity to the polymer chain. Here. Um, it contains also uh, some chemical elements like carbon and hydrogen. Okay. Like I mentioned before, it's not expensive per unit weight. It's a poor barrier to oxygen and water vapor, and it has relative low melting mm, melting point compared to other polymers. Okay. Okay. So the structure, uh, it can be a tactic, which is referred to the regular polystyrene. It can be syndrotactic, which is uh, has a higher melting point and more highly ordered structure, and azotactic, which is not produced commercially. Like I mentioned, uh, polystyrene is a thermoplastic. Uh, pure thermo, uh, pure uh, polystyrene is colorless, brittle, and hard plastic. No, no, I'm sorry, not hard plastic, brittle plastic. When heated, it melts to the liquid, and when cooled, it freezes to the brittle, glassy state, allowing the uh, polystyrene to be molded and extruded. Okay? talk about advantages and some disadvantages of uh, polystyrene okay so advantages gonna start with advantages um, it's uh, it's uh, it's amorphous which is has zero crystallinity okay it has a good resistance to water absorption good electrical insulation properties it has good chemical resistance to acids alkali salts However, it has some disadvantages, which is uh, polystyrene is not flame resistant, and it has low heat resistance. You can see on the right side, uh, on the table, properties. A technical name, polystyrene, PS for short, um, abbreviation, uh, chemical formula, C8H8, melt temperature, 210 to 49, 3866 injection mold temperature, 95 uh, Celsius is a heat uh, deflection temperature, uh, tensile strength, which is really low, 7700 PSI. Flexure strength is 12,000 psi. Specific gravity has uh, 1.04, and sh shrink rate has uh, 0.03. No, sorry, 0.3 to 0.7 percent. Okay. So how is it made, guys? How is it made? So polystyrene is widely used of a variety of products. It used in products uh, that require clarity, such as food packaging and laboratory wear. The solid plastic form of polystyrene is commonly used in medical device applications like test tubes, petri dishes, ADCs, um, etc. Like um, how stuff and stuff like that. You know, combining with uh, various colorant additives, polystyrene is used to make uh, electronics, automobile parts, toys, insulation, medical application, etc. And I will show you later the pictures. Okay, and here you can see uh, the process of uh, down here uh, figure two process of polymerization of styrene how it um, from this become this it's uh, polymerization it it's uh, kind of like many many you know uh, polystyrene results when styrene monomers are connected to each other and uh, the polymerization the carbon carbon double bond is broken and new carbon carbon single bond is formed attaching another styrene monomer to the chain like you see here okay okay so usage some disadvantages, it's amorphous in nature, meaning it's uh, real brittle, uh, has a lower impact resistance, like I mentioned before, easy to crack, um, turn yellow on exposure of sunlight, okay, and difficult to recycle, which is bad thing, and bad for environment, most end up in landfills, which is really bad, really bad. And here in figure 3, you can see recycle, symbol code for polystyrene is number 6, okay, like I mentioned. Uh, it can be it uses in packaging, insulation, food containers, electric casings, toys, and piping. Um, next slide, you will see the. Yes, I'm sorry. Uh, figure four packaging, 
packing, uh, fuel fire toys, food container, styrofoam insulation. All of them made out of uh, styrofoam, which is uh, polystyrene. Okay. Okay. And uh, conclusion, what can we talk about conclusion? So let's summarize. So polystyrene plastic is commonly used in variety of consumers product applications such as food container, a medical application, such as CD cases, etc. Okay. And it has some disadvantages and some advantages. Bad thing uh, about recycling polystyrene has a limitation of usage, meaning it cannot be used for food container again because of the health concerns. On the other side, it gives high performance, uh, impurity of products, and it's cheap, which is economy. It's really cheap. So that's about it. So do you have any questions? So if you have questions, please leave me a comment below or uh, I will ask myself a question. So I didn't mention how much the cost of, of a polystyrene per unit of the weight. So do you guys know? If you don't, then uh, it's the next slide. How much you buy? Average is 410 to 484 per gallon, okay? Which is not bad, which is not expensive compared to others, okay?